I have helped some people and I believe the more people I help, I believe I began to understand people more. And I think I understand my past more as well too. I think many people hear from demons and from, I guess I can say the Holy Spirit as well. I truly think so. It seems like to me, people rather, I guess I can say, maybe out of ignorance, rather hear from demons than the Holy Spirit. And you may say, Kevin, that is crazy. What are you talking about? Okay, give me time. Okay. If, let's say, a thought comes to your mind, like, you are stupid, which I don't like saying that. You are stupid. You are worthless. People hate you. You are better off dead. Okay. And let's say some thoughts come to your mind and tell you you are not stupid. You are worth wild or worth something. You are loved. You are cared for. I think most people will grab hold onto the negative thoughts and may believe the positive thoughts aren't true, but the negative thoughts aren't true. I mean, <laughs> what? <laughs> Some people may believe the negative thoughts, thoughts are true, and the positive thoughts are just their imagination. Some people can tell you what you are saying is not true. You are not worthless. But still, you rather, if this applies to you, you rather hold on to those negative thoughts as if it is your baby or something like that. Why? Why would you? I believe those thoughts are coming from demons. If they are coming from demons, why hold on to thoughts coming from demons, huh? Even if you have people coming to you telling you it is not true, why are you still holding on to it? Kevin, they are just being nice and there is nothing positive about me. I am worthless. I might as well kill myself. What type of thinking is that? Is that type of thinking from God? If you know there is a God, if you know there are demons, if you know demons want you to die and go to hell, if thoughts are very discouraging to the point to where you don't want to live or you feel so bad about yourself, is that God placing those thoughts into your mind? Can it be demons? I believe so. What you should do when negative thoughts come to your mind, push them away. Kevin, they continue to come to my mind and I want them to stop, but they continue to come, so they must be true. Okay. So if I were to come to you, and tell you every day for three hours a day, grass is blue. Grass is blue. 
Grass is blue. Grass is blue. Does it make it true? If I tell you I live on Mars, <laughs> Uncle Kev live on Mars, and I tell you that every day, does it make it true? So if there are reoccurring thoughts coming to your mind over and over again, does it make it true? Does it mean those thoughts are coming from you? I don't think so. Unhook yourself from demonic thoughts. Don't be impulsive. Listen to, I guess, the thoughts that you may believe is coming from the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is not going to tell you you are ugly. The Holy Spirit may tell you you need to change. The Holy Spirit may tell you you need to be kind to people and stuff like that, but I don't think the Holy Spirit is going to be insulting. I don't think the Holy Spirit is going to tell you to kill yourself or you should go to hell right now. I don't think the Holy Spirit is going to tell you to go to witchcraft. Right? Unhook yourself from negative thinking because what is it doing for you? Is it progressing you in life in a positive way? Is it doing any good for you? I think not. So let me stop here. God bless you.